Hey folks, let's learn something new about the oil and gas industry. All right, today we're in downtown Houston with Neil Wynn. How you doing, Neil? Pretty good. Yeah, and in case you can't tell, it's actually cold in Houston. It's 49 degrees, <laughs> yeah, which the rest of the country would think was a spring day, but it's cold here. So, Neil, well, you got a fascinating story, right? You do something I have never heard of before. It's, it's a search fund, is that correct? Yeah, that's right. So, um, it, the search fund model is actually fairly young in, in terms of the business model, but it started about in, back in 1984 by the Stanford GSB, the Stanford Business School. And really, two main schools are Stanford and, and Harvard, and they've really been cultivating it. Today, there's only been about 220, 240 search funds that have been started overall uh, throughout the history of the business. So it's actually a really unique model in that there's two rounds of funding. The initial round is the support for the search. So over the next 18 to 24 months, I'm going to be searching for a good business to buy. So what I'm doing right now in the initial search is I'm going around to potential investors and saying, look, support me for the next two years. I'm going to find a good business to buy. Then I'm going to come back for a second round of funding, significantly larger, um, but we're going to purchase that business. And then I'm going to run the business for the next five, seven, 10 years. So it's, it's a little bit different than a private equity, a standard private equity play, right? Because this is more of a long-term focus. This is a firm of one, right? I want to buy one company, I want to buy a good company, and then I want to run it over the long term. And the thing I think is really cool, so the search fund thing is unique, and there's not a lot of people doing it, but you're even niching it more, right? You're focusing on oil and gas. Yeah, well, ideally, I want to base on my experiences. So I spent the last two and a half years, a little bit of background on me, born and raised in Austin, Texas, played football at the Air Force Academy, blew up my knee, uh, Air Force officer for five years, got out. I was a Lean Six Sigma black belt for GE Oil and Gas here in Houston. Love the oil and gas industry, love Houston, love Texas. So ideally would love to be in oil and gas and look for a small to medium sized business of 10 to $50 million in revenue, right? Within the oil and gas uh, sphere. However, I am not gonna limit my investors potential on a uh, profitable en en endeavor. So definitely gonna do industrial search within oil and gas. However, you know, a, a software company in, <laughs> in Seattle ha is just right, but my, my focus is definitely gonna be within oil and gas. Yeah, and so a lot of people have to go, well, Neil, Oil and gas industry is hurting. You and I were talking about this off camera. The oil and gas industry, the entire industry is not hurting, is it? No, actually, no, it's, it is definitely not. Because when you look downstream right now, you know, it's 30% of the standard cost it was two years ago, which if you put a 30%, you know, if your key component is now 70% cheaper, yeah, your business is going to be booming. And to be honest, even upstream, it, you know, it's a, it's a correction. I think we're all feeling that right now. Um, but, it, you know, it's, it's a cyclical environment. We know that Houston as a whole, the industry as a whole, and the, the energy sector as a whole has really prepared and learned on past boom and bust. So it, I think this is actually a really good time to be doing something like this because there's a lot of opportunity. There's going to be, you know, you got downstream is booming and upstream. Yeah, there might be a few times where that, that business owner is like, I just don't want to go through this again, but I want my legacy to keep on. And that's where we that's where the Hill Growth Fund, uh, my company that we started, it comes in and says, look, we want to take it over. We want to focus on the good business principles that were already established. We want to keep it going. And this is a long term play. This isn't 18 months from now we sell out. Right. This is a long term investment growth. So if anybody out there has a business and they're interested in getting in touch with you and just talking to you and see if it's a good fit, where should they go? Yeah, so definitely uh, willing to talk more, you know, have laptop, will travel. Um, it's the, uh, the company we started is The Hill Growth Fund. So you can go to www.thehillgrowthfund.com. Um, it's a standard website, gives you kind of more information, more readings uh, about what the search fund is, a little bit further background on myself and why I am suitable to, why I feel I'm suitable to run the company and take it to that next level. Um, and then, of course, it has my contact information. Um, really not geographically focused. Um, again, even in, within oil and gas, oil and gas is a huge industry. It's a very exciting time, I think, personally. Would love to find something within the oil and gas. Again, um, not going to limit my, my investors' ability to make a profit. But yeah. So, folks, we'll put a link in the show notes so you have to write stuff down. Neil, thank you so much for your time today. Yeah, thanks for your time. I appreciate you coming down. Look forward to finding a good business to buy. Yeah. So, folks, I hope this helped. We will see you next time.